Santa's coming to town. Santa! Oh my God! Hello everybody, welcome back to another live stream. <clears throat> I promise I'm trying with my voice, it's it's not doing great. I still have my morning voice even after hours being awake. Um, hi, welcome everyone to the stream. Um, before we start it, I want to show you guys the cute little like server thing we got going on. It's adorable, I know. It says, welcome to Peachy's Pixel Place. It has a cute little like heart. Riley did that. It was very, very sweet of her. I tried to do the icon, but it's a little blurry, but I'm getting it fixed. We're getting it fixed. So yeah. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Let me look at stream chat. For some reason, Streamlabs is not showing me stream chat anymore. It's great. Hi, Jenny. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Jenny. Oh my gosh. Stop. You're going to make me blush. You're going to make me blush. Blush, bruv. What did you guys say there in the, the UK? I'm a proud <laughs> Chewisinator, no. <laughs> Please, no. Um, oh, here are the AI horses. Ignore those. We're not going to look at those. That was from my TikTok last night. Oh my gosh. Here's the other, the other UK person. Thank you, Matthew. I love you. Thank you, Matthew, for the five gifted memberships. Congratulations, everyone, on the membership. That's my boyfriend. Making his appearance known. Um, Florida, yeah, Florida Mary is... Mary Chrysler. Flo Mary Chrysler. I'm just going to let it play out. I'm just gonna let it play out. Mary Chrysler. Thank you, Isabella. You're so sweet. Um, Mary Chrysler. Mary Chrysler. <laughs> Peach, I'm sending Tara Macy fan art. Yes, I want to put it. I want to put put more fan art in my videos. Please send me all your fan art, even if it's like. Even if you're like, no, Peachy would never put this put this in her video. Like, it's, it's not worthy of her videos. No, I will. Send them to me. I will. Trust me. Hi, Jenny. I miss you. You're saying I have competition? Yes, I'm so sorry. Competition of your own kinds. He's, he's, from, he's from your country. You do have competition. I'm sorry. One second, let me get everything set up here. Okay, there we go. So all the horses are out in the pasture. Um, let me go ahead and get everyone into their stalls really quick while I look at stream chat. Me too. Paint it forward because someone gifted for me, probably Jessica. Yeah, I think it was Jessica who gifted. It was either that or Sophia, and then you, you were in stream. 
That was the stream I asked. I was like, were you in today's stream? And you were like, I don't think so. And then I saw that you got member in that stream and I was like, you little liar. You knew you were in stream. You probably just weren't in stream for the entire thing. I don't have competition, I'm always winning. <laughs> A true twisternator. Peach will be there, will there be ponies in V2? Yes, there will be ponies and drafts and other models. Um, does a swim horse eat an only survival? Um, currently the horses aren't eating due to a, a known bug. So some of them do. I have people who've said that they don't have the bug or like it only, the horse, horses go in and out of eating, but it really depends. Yes, swim is free. Minecraft is not though. And we do not support cracked Minecraft, so yeah. Hi, Leah. Let me see what you guys are saying. I'm gonna go get Christmas cookies. I'm so jealous. Okay, we're gonna do the stallions and geldings first. Okay, you guys just chill here. Don't walk out too far, please. Pyralis goes in first. I did their stall setup last night. Well, like their stall was already set up, but I mean like I gave them more food and water because I have been eating. Another peach. Hi, Stephanie. Am I a mother? Oh my gosh. I'm not ready for this responsibility. Oh, guys, surprise. I'm a mom. Mother to Eric. That's it. <laughs> hey, Lena. Welcome. Um, yeah, you can get swam as long as like if you're under the age of 13, I do recommend getting a parent's permission because, you know, downloading stuff from the internet without parent's permission or without their supervision can be quite risky. Um, take it from me who downloaded many viruses onto my family computer when I was a kid thinking I was downloading some cool game. I was not downloading some cool game. <laughs> Matthew, wait a minute. Did you miss a lot? No, you did not, Tundra. Welcome. Oh my gosh, this is a mess. You know, we're just gonna... We're gonna take out the gates for a second to do this because these gates are not very multi-horse friendly. I would bring them in one by one, but that takes too much time and I'm too lazy for that. Yeah, the content of Roomy Boy is just, it's not safe for work, you know? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Get off the lead, please. Thank you. Okay, you're in there. Jazz, you're next. Yeah, as I said, you no know, eating and drinking, that is currently a um, known bug. So I wouldn't worry too much about that. It is being fixed. Your horses will not die. That's one thing I've said in every stream. Your horses won't die from not being fed or watered. They'll just not be very happy. You're eating nuggies? And you didn't get me any? I'm so jealous. You know what I miss eating, but like my store literally doesn't sell them? Dino nuggies. Bye, Matthew. I love you. Show them the worm. I I capped them. The worm. We're gonna string them up. That sounds really bad. Okay, hold on. Can you like put it? Can you like be part of the chandelier? Oh my gosh, you can. <laughs> yeah, Jazz has superpowers. I forgot to tell you guys. She's literally a super horse. Let's get the brush going. The sugar cubes and apples. I'm gonna prepare for attacking the horses up really quick. Okay, so the first horse we're going to ride today is going to be one of the fan favorites. We're going to be riding Terame Sue. And I'm pretty sure I already set up her stats, right? I did not. Okay, give me a second, guys. You guys don't see this happening, okay? And her jump was three. And her affinity 
was like max 20, 12. Yeah, okay. I was reading it wrong. She was bonded with me and I had to reset her because I got her on the new server, on my server. So I had to reset her stats. Yeah, guys, don't look. It's too graphic. I'm going to get demonetized, Jenny, because I showed Wormy Boy. That's just how it is. My horse would not tolerate that. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go look at her. I don't think I even reset up the tack boxes, did I? No, I did not. Let's go and get her reset up. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, see her food and water levels are down. And if you just take... I think if you just feed them manually, it, it helps, right? Does it do that? Yeah, so if you just hand feed them and hand water them, unless you have a lot of horses and you just you just don't want to do that every day, it's up to you, then yeah, it should be, should be good. Let me finish the place so nicely. Thank you. Yeah, guys, Jenny in chat, she's the one who built this. She's the, she's the famous, the famous show barn builder. I do all that right, yeah. Do some grooming down, oh, bridle first. I always, like, without fail, I always do the saddle pad first by accident, and it's a problem. We're gonna go ahead and put this in her tack box because I'm not going to keep the tack after. We put this in the grooming so on the tack. We're going to get our little helmet on. Unless I already have it on, I do not. Let's get some boots on. Look at the little helmet. It's so cute. I posted a video about this pack today, guys, if you guys want to check it out. Yeah, some Jenny appreciation in chat, please. Okay, so I haven't actually set up the jumps yet, but we're gonna ride out to the arena really quick because I need to actually like scope out and see where I want the jumps. I'm not sure yet. I actually already have, no, I don't have jumps. I have jumps in the warm up. We can go to the warm up really quick. Yeah, Jenny, have you seen like all the updates? I think you've watched some of my streams with the updates, but yeah. Um, this over here is, oh wait, have I even shown? I'm not sure if, I don't think Rachel said I couldn't. Um, Rachel over here is building her little barn. She's gonna be hosting some shows as well. And then over here is Joel and Jessica as they've been working on that one as well. So yeah, just wanna show that really quick. I was inspired by Peach's old barns. I gave you like two photos and they were the crappiest photos ever. <laughs> nah, you get the credit for making it such a beautiful barn without like barely any reference. I felt so bad because I couldn't get any of my old photos from my old barns. And it was just, I was like, okay, well, I hope this helps. And I, <laughs> I don't know how you did it because it would not have helped me if I was a builder. I'm gonna do some warm ups. Oh my gosh, wait, how does she jump that quick? Hold on. That was actually a really good combination. Love your videos, Peachy. Thank you, Tundra. How do I join the server? Um, currently, the server's not open. I'm hoping to open it by January or February. I was going to do it before Christmas, but I have so much work to do on it. Um, I'm going to be organizing like a show system, a breeding system, a economy system. So it's. I'm going to be hoping to make the server like completely reliable on like its own systems and not pay to play because i feel like i don't want to make it pay to play other than just the membership you need to join the server because it was originally my personal server so i was like i'll allow my vip members on there because they're supporting my they're supporting my um my my channel so and the different tiers of the 
of the memberships there's three currently there used to be two but i created a third one they'll be getting different perks in game but it won't like separate their gameplay with other players if that makes sense like they'll have availability to different areas opportunities to join different areas but it won't like make them better than the other players if that makes sense so i wanted to make it that way so it's not like well i feel bad because now this person can't afford to go to a new area or something so yeah Become a member, you won't regret it. Irish man, hi. Welcome. Hi, mom. Hi, Liv. Peach, I'm getting swam in a week. Congratulations. Can I gallop? Heck yeah. Termisu loves to gallop. She's speed. Okay. Let's go in here and do these jumps. I wish Rachel were on. I think she's at work right now because I want to get like out of body shots to show you guys what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Oh, oh, how did I do that? That was so cool. Hello, American lady. Hi, it's me. I'm American. You have to adopt us all now. Oh my gosh. How many, how many people am I mothering? How many people are in this chat? 94. I don't, I can't afford that. I can barely even afford my own child, my own cat. Okay, please. Did you marry me? Hold on. When did it go from be my mother to marry me? Hold on. All right, so let's go ahead and make some jumps really quick. Let me get an anchor lead so I can tie down this horse. Tara Mae Sue's a wanderer. She does not like staying put, and it's a very... Scary time when you can't find your horse you just left alone. Um, I want to make some... I have an idea and I want to see if I can do it. We're gonna try to make a Christmas jump. Oh, coded chain rat, I was typing it wrong. Hey, remember what's the very PG has to get in line? Even Matthew is behind you. Ooh, don't let Matthew hear that. This music is so cheerful. Okay, I turned down the music a little bit because I didn't want it to be too loud. This is not going to be the, the best jump I've ever made. I'm sorry. Jenny, you're, you're going to want to drop me after you see me build this jump. I'm sorry. It's going to be uneven. I don't like that. After all this time, and I'm still not good at making jumps. Wait, I want to marry Peachy. Hold on. Hold on. Why are we, like, creating lines right now? Why are there, why is there lines? I'm sorry. My boyfriend's going to join stream again and be like, what is going on? I left for five minutes. He left for five minutes and he lost his girlfriend. It's not going to be okay. That is not a cute, that is not a cute jump, I'm not gonna lie, but at the same time, um, I'm not really looking for anything super fancy. Oh my gosh, why is that like shouting? Vince! Tell Matthew we were here first. Actually, yeah, you were. No, yeah, you, you definitely were here first, but it's not like, is it first dips? I don't know. I mean, Jenny Jenny did send some flirty texts first, not gonna lie. Gonna make some with the red glass bricks. I'm trying to make like Christmas style jumps and it's not gonna look very great. Oh, 
I don't like it being on Eva and it bothers me. All my cat g kissing gifts wasted. No, I'm sorry. It's not you, it's me. Oh my gosh. If we get, if I hit 100k subscribers in this stream, I will leak Jenny and I's conversations on Discord. I'll be canceled. No. Now it makes me sound like I'm saying something incriminating. I promise it's not. I have ultimate risk. You really do. Oh, I didn't know you were taken. Yeah, I actually am. No, it's okay. Honestly, I don't, I'm going to be, I, I don't know if it's like a toxic thing, but I just don't take anything serious on stream. So if somebody's being serious at any time, I'm like, okay. I am. I am taken. I'm sorry. She really dumped us for a guy. A man. I'm sorry. That's a banned word in the stream. I did. I love him though. I'm sorry. Okay, technically Jenny, technically Jenny, I, I had Riz when you were with your man. So, I mean, we need to catch up by the way. We haven't talked in so, Oh, it's the subscriber thing. We haven't talked in so long. I need to get that Riz back. A real man has taken you from us. Honestly. Honestly. Yeah. He's... He has. I would say taken. But, yeah. Taken. It's like he's kidnapped me. A nuclear explosion, honestly. It's just us flirting, basically. Okay, so what is she at now? She's at jump three, still at speed two. She's bonded. I'm gonna go ahead and bring her back to the barn. Actually, I can just walk her back to the barn. The wormy boy, the wormy boy chandelier. Gotta walk past that. Was there ever a chance? Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't really know. I don't really talk. I don't really talk about my relationship often, especially on stream, but um, I don't think so. <laughs> um, Wait, it's in here. There we go. And next we're gonna do the eventing horses because I wanna go out on the eventing track. I haven't even finished the eventing track yet. I've had so much time to and I've just been so busy. Peachy has a Riz, oh my gosh, she does. I don't even know what my Riz is. Probably just really awkward jokes. Not gonna lie. I don't know how to flirt, I'm sorry. Um, let's do... Uh, let's do Pyralis, because I feel like we did Dolphin last time. Bye, Jenny. Love you. I already miss you. Oh, I haven't talked to Jenny so long. I'm slowly, I'm, I'm losing, losing life force right now. I miss her. Are there new jumps? Um, So the jumps that I have out in the arena right now are from the CIT pack that Moonflower made. I made a video about it today. You guys should go check it out. Oh my gosh, you guys see his little shake shake? So cute. Um, But yeah, I made that video and I put it out. Um. It's a really cool CIT pack for those who like more equestrian stuff in their game and like decorations. There we go. Now I can see the difference between the English and the Western.
me go ahead and get his tack box next. All the tack boxes were unbound because they were just like copy and pasted from another world. So I have to redo them all. I thought I already redid them, but I did not. Okay, we're gonna go, we forgot to groom him. It's fine, just gonna do right now. He's full on food and water. And this one I'm gonna take, well, dressage whip, I don't know. Maybe we could go do some dressage as well. I'll just keep it in my inventory just in case. What have you missed? Nothing much. I just rode Teramesu. I'm about to ride Pyralis. I'm going to go bring him to the cross-country track. How long will the stream be? I'm not sure. I'm hoping to have like a pretty big stream today, at least for like an hour, an hour and a half, because I haven't talked to you guys in a while, like an actually big stream on swim. So, and by a while, I mean like a week. I've missed you guys. Wait, come back. I have attachment issues. How do you get the whip peachy? Um, with the CIT pack. My most recent video explains it. He's speed one. We're going to have to get him up in speed because he's not going to be able to make some of these jumps with speed one. It takes so much concentration to jump horses. I'm sorry. It's very difficult. These jumps haven't been set up yet. Cross country. I have um, Horse Racing Club, the the Roblox game I have. I don't play Roblox at all. Like, I played Wild Horse Islands, and it was just, I don't know. I just couldn't get into it. And I hope with, with uh, Horse Racing Club I can, but I have, like, no want to spend money on Roblox because in order to get, like, certain outfits and stuff, you need to have, like, what is it, Robux? So... Yeah. Welcome to your first stream, South. Peach, I'm at my grandma's house. Oh my gosh. What's grandma cooking? What's she cooking for dinner? Um, We're hoping to add some sort of, or I think dressage moves and animations are hoped for, but there's nothing like solidified about that because of us really not knowing if it'll work. Um, really depends. I have been wanting to play Horse Valley, yeah. Don't offend me. I'm sorry. <laughs> my gosh, my bad. Welcome. Try Maple Springs. Eventing. It's so realistic. Oh, okay. See, like... I don't like want to disrespect any games like that, but it's just like I haven't been able to get into it. But then somebody could say the same thing about Minecraft. So it really just depends on the person. I would never like say, oh my gosh, Roblox is like a children's game and I don't like it. Because there's people, there's like all different ages that play Roblox. It's just not a game I was able to get into. Simple as that. But I will try my best. I look like a, I look like a social, or a, yeah, social studies teacher on Roblox because I have like the default clothing. So I think I may just need to like spend money on Robux one of these times, Robux, and get an outfit. Do you have a favorite horse game? I don't really know. I've been trying to like slowly, I know this sounds horrible, like slowly get out of horse games and explore other games, but I know you guys love horse games, so it's kind of difficult to do that. I won't be offended only because you apologized. You know what? I revoke my apology. I revoke my apology video with tears. 
Are you late? Not too late. We're just riding Pyralis around. I'm just trying to get a speed up. I got it up to two. What I'm hoping to do is kind of like how um, Swim VIP is, how it's a little bit more difficult to get your horse's levels up. I'm hoping to make it that way for my server so that training takes longer. Because I feel like you could just speed run training with your horses. Like it obviously takes a while, but it doesn't take as long as like the VIP horses. So do you want a horse IRL? No, I can't afford that. And plus we don't have the space. Hi, Bubble. <clears throat> I'm glad my morning voice is gone. That was so bad. I could like feel my morning voice still be there. What world are you playing right now? I'm playing on my server. Oh, for those who weren't here for my like first Christmas decorating stream, I want to show you guys this really quick. Don't worry. I'll, I, I remember where he's at. He's not being left alone. Well, he is for a second, but he's like not going to be left there. I decorated my property for Christmas. Isn't it so pretty for the ranch? I'm not going to decorate my show barn because my show barn isn't going to have like a storyline on during Christmas. So um, yeah. I'm going to create a storyline, a cute little storyline video for Christmas, so I need the ranch to be decorated. Where did he go? <gasps> there you are, Pyralis. Come here. Do you know, if, but do you have a server anyone can join? Not at the moment. I just, I'm allowing friends and, like, staff members to join. Um, I'm about to open it up for staff members in a little bit once we get staff plots done so they can start building their stuff. And then I'm going to have builders come on and build some community areas with me. Um, currently, I only have one builder, but going to have more soon. Oh my gosh, you're using my my full, my government name right now, Tundra. I don't know, whenever I read Carissa, I feel like I'm in trouble. I'm like, oh God. I don't know how to use the purple horse armor. I can show you how to use the horse armor in just a second. Let me swim around this. Let me cheat really quick. Go up on the land, thank you. Can I gallop back to the horse barn? Yes, if he allows me to. There we go. Can we do this jump really quick, Paralys, please? Thank you. Since he's an eventing horse, he should really know how to jump certain jumps because eventing is show jumping, cross country, and dressage. See you on Wednesday. Bye. See you on Wednesday. The mods are the, um, that's signpost. It's like the signpost mods. Um, it's on CurseForge if you just look up signpost. If you go to my Oasis Valley tour video, in the description are all the mods I use. I want to put in all of my videos and streams, but I just, I'm going to be honest, I genuinely just keep on forgetting to. Um, Tara May Sue can't even jump the highest jump because she is, uh, she's jump three. They need to be jump five to jump the highest. Let me go put this in his tack chest before I forget. Which horse should we do next? Should we start a little vote? Do you watch the show Wednesday? No, I have not. I want to get into it. Um, honestly, I haven't had any time to watch TV except for like last night and I watched like a documentary, a docu-series I've been wanting to watch. Am I ignoring you? I'm sorry. No, um, flying is not in V2. Or sorry, in V1. It'll be in V2. I can't speak. Flying isn't in V1. I'm sorry. You can also, you can put the wings on though. So how to get the armor on the horse is you need full adventure attack. So you need adventure saddle, adventure blankets. And then you can put the armor on. That's how you spell armor. Nice. Um, let's go ahead and do the netherite horse armor because it's my favorite. And you can also do the netherite saddle as well instead of the adventure saddle because it like it's in theme. Let 
and boom, it's there. And then if you press the period button on your, oh, you want kings? Everyone want kings, okay. Um, if you put the period button on the keyboard, you can do wings and then this one has transparent and then gone. So yeah, it's very pretty. Looks really good. Put them back in his stall. They've already been turned out today, so I'm not worried about turning them out right now. Okay, you guys wanted kings. Kings, they want to see you on the channel. Come here. I haven't done a video or like anything with kings in a hot minute. I just wrote them yesterday, but like still. Um, so the rainbow jump comes from the Equestrian CIT pack by Moonflower. My most recent video that I just posted today shows how to get the CIT pack and showcases it. Thank you, Peach. A new problem. Oh my gosh. Thank you, horse and wolf lover. Let me go get... Jumping with Kings, sadly, Kings is a dressage horse, so we have to go do dressage with him. Hello, Kings. Oh my gosh, guys, beans. For the OGs, they remember the beans. I wouldn't say OGs, but for like the, the regulars. They remember the beans. Wormy boy? <laughs> Ride pumpkin next? Okay, we can ride pumpkin in the snowy weather next, for sure. Explain it. Um, I was looking for little apple, like, skulls to put on the, um, like, the you know, the little Minecraft heads that look like apples? I was going to put them on the tree, so I was looking for them on a Minecraft head site, and I ended up finding beans. And so I put that on my barn. Oh, is there lag? Uh oh. Yes, um, my downloadable stables. I I can show you guys it really quick. Where is the command block? Where was it? It's right here. Here is. Here's the schematic. Um, so this is the map. It's literally just a flat world. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and I'm going to take um, some pastures. I'm going to make some trees and a forest. And then I'm going to be able to make this downloadable. So you guys can download it onto your map. But I haven't actually had any time to work on it. So I need to set apart a few days. I've just been so busy, you know. So yeah. Um, how do I get back? Hold on. I totally know how to do this. I have no idea how to get back. Riley, please help. I knew I had it pinned, but I don't have it pinned anymore. This is awkward. And I have home set here. What did I just do?
Hmm. Give me a second, guys. I can figure this out. I got this, I promise. This is awkward. <sighs> Wait, Riley's online. I think I may have it pinned in my chat. Oh, Peachy, there we go. Private. Run TP Chawissa. Okay, um, there we go. Oh my gosh, guys, my life just flashed before my eyes. Where's my horse? Sorry guys, that was like a few minutes of confusion. Uh, we didn't even lose any people. You guys just sat through through my confusion. Thank you. I feel like horse girl, I don't know. I feel like a lot of people say this, but horse girl, I feel like it's just like a bullying expression. Like yeah, horse girl, it's just like a girl who loves horses. But at the same time, it's like, I feel like the term has been so memes to a point where it's like oh here comes the horse girl and it's like okay at that point it's just a meme and i feel like people use it poorly but at the same time you can't really force people to see it in the way that you see it so it's um it's a problem but you can't really do much about it You know what, sir? I'm gonna have to. Oh my gosh, why are you, why are you coming at me like that? Wait, why are you chasing me like that? Please. What do you want? Wait, hold on. Are you gonna hurt me? Twenty-five years. Oh my gosh, you've been here for a second. I'm gonna tie you up really quick so that I can um come back later for you. I'm sorry. It's like, no, please. Please come back. Okay, bye. Thank you so much for joining. Donkeys are so cute. It depends. Okay, well, it depends on the donkey. Some people don't train their donkeys, and some people just, like, let their donkeys run free. And you meet some pretty mean donkeys. Mules, though. I love mules. Like, people who ride mules, they're the cutest. I had a friend who used to ride, like, a hunter's mule. It was so cute. Every time I look at my camera, I'm like, oh, my gosh, my posture. Please. <sighs> I need to straighten up my posture. So... I ask this in pretty much every stream, but what kind of what kind of movies and shows have you guys been watching? Because I've been wanting to get into more stuff. Right now, I've just been watching a bunch of docu series. I just finished a docu series on how this guy, right, trapped like three girls in his basement. I think you guys have probably heard of it. And 
10 years later, they all escaped. Wednesday. I know I've heard so much about Wednesday. I open up TikTok and it's Wednesday content. <laughs> Free reign and Just Peachy. Have you heard of her? I don't think so. Just Peachy. It sounds really familiar, but I don't know. Yeah, I've met Just Peachy. She's kind of rude. She's kind of mean. It's actually my biggest fear one day. It's like a famous creator. I meet a famous creator and they're like, yeah, she was so mean. And I'm like, okay. If I hear like the the Wednesday song again of her dancing, I'm going to actually lose it. <gasps> Excuse me. Sorry. I don't, I, I get the hype in a way because it's a really well-made show and I really do like how it's accurate to the like the older like the comics version or like the written version of Wednesday or like the you know Adam's family but I don't know I just remember the the actual show it's like you know the song I really loved it anyways oh dance 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 yeah, no, I can. <laughs> Why'd you put it in my head again? I love this song, but it's like, if I hear like the little like, do, do, do thing again, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. With my hands, hands, hands. Now it's playing in my brain. Thank you for that. Oh, Horse and Wolf, I'm glad you had a fun ride today. <sighs> Sorry. I'm yawning so bad. I just yawned right into my mic. Oh my gosh, guys. Yawning ASMR. Welcome back to just peachy ASMR. I just met my brother's girlfriend and she's the best. Aw, I love when siblings get along with like their siblings, their other siblings, significant others. It's great. Like, I'm happy that I'm able to get on, get along with my siblings, significant others. One more time. Thank you, Matthew. Matthew, you made someone's day. Oh, wait, what is that? Why is there invisible block? Excuse me. Oh, Matthew's here? What the heck? I thought you were gone. I feel like you'd be very good at ASMR. I feel like I would, wouldn't would be able to take it seriously. It would just be meme ASMR. It'd be like sushi purring or me like coughing into my mic. My gosh, you sound really protective, Phoenix. <laughs> oh my gosh. Going back for a little bit. Hi. She's invested. Everyone's animals, I swear. I had someone who joined in, and every time she joined in, she would send me pictures on Instagram of her dogs watching her TV while she watched my streams. I was like, oh my gosh, animals are interested. Can he even jump? Mm, he's jumped too, but he's tolerant. He doesn't like me. I haven't even said his stats. I'm not going to at this point. Should we do some galloping? Come on. Gallop, please. Thank you. What do you guys have planned for, for the next week? A lot of you guys are on, on Christmas vacation, right? For like college and school. I think that school gets out like the week before Christmas. And you guys just have that entire week. But I may be wrong. I don't know. I remember at my school, they would let us out, like, I think half a week before Christmas, and then we'd have the week after Christmas off, and then we'd come back to school, and then we'd get spring break off next. My school ends on Friday. Okay, so the week before Christmas. Nice. Nice. We finish school on the 23rd. That's like two days before Christmas. They don't like give you time to like spend time with family and decorate. I'm sorry. Bye Leah, thank you so much for joining. I hope you become a regular, I'm gonna be watching. I'm gonna be keeping track of who joins. 
I'm going to be grading your attendance. I'm going to, up to Scotland for Xmas, for Christmas. Scotland, jeez, that's a dream. What area in Scotland? Like what, not like exact, obviously like exact town, but like what part of Scotland? Sounds really cool. Can you ride pumpkin now? Yes, I can. We're going to actually ride Terramaisu. over to the, uh, the ranch because I want her to go be pasture with pumpkin for the day because I always pasture them together when she's over there. I'm going to be in Minnesota for Christmas. Wow. Minnesota. I for, I'm going to be honest. I forgot that state existed for a hot second. Oh my gosh, you're cute. How old are you? <gasps> Damn, 24 years. I have a blocked nose and it's really annoying me. I'm sorry. I hope you feel better soon. Oh, I went to the wrong side. I meant to go over here. Please let me in. Thank you. Where is it at? Oh, it's on the other side of the trail. Okay, so we're going to go through here. There we go. That's the trail I was looking for. Are you asking me when my birthday is or somebody else? I'm staying here in Switzerland. Do you guys have snow by then? I'm guessing you do. Stop making me yawn. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm yawning so much. I got decent sleep. I slept so late. See, I want to yawn again. Hold on. Ooh. I need to drink something or I'm going to keep on yawning. Oh, it's the 29th of February. Happy early birthday. I'm two months early. Or am I like really late? For your old birthday. Oh, Phoenix, that's cute. My birthday is August 17th. So it's a hot minute until my birthday. Time to go see your bestie for the resty. Oh, you know who this is? This is Rachel's horse that she wanted to get or she wanted to have. But she didn't come and get it because she already made her horse at the barn. So I'm just going to put it in here. Um, Pumpkin, you have a friend in here. He's just going to stay for a bit, okay? Come here, Pumpkin. Newton's like, wait, what about my friend? Newton actually does follow her around. Like, I can't make it up. Oh my gosh, when you finally sneeze, it's like the best feeling. I'm sorry, but like... When your sneezes just like block themselves over and over again, it's horrible. I hate it. It's the worst feeling. You live in England? Oh my gosh, so many Brits in this chat right now. Pip pip cherry I love. Wait, where did where did Teramesu go? <gasps> Look, it's your bestie Teramesu. She's like, oh my gosh, is that pumpkin? It is pumpkin. Come and look. Come and see your best friends. Look at her. You're not even gonna look at your bestie? Thank you. You guys can have your little best friend moment, okay? I do have a dog. Her name is Maybell. Okay, so we're gonna put Teramesu. This used to be your barn, Teramesu. She used to stay here before I built the English barn, before it finished. And moved the horses all over. I'm going to get Pumpkin ready to go. Let's go, pumpkin. Yeah, follow the sugar cube. Just like, oh my god, sugar cube. A sprinkle today of snow. <laughs> we got some snow uh, the other night. Like, we had some flurries, but we didn't actually get, like, snow. It just flurried for a second, and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna go grab my phone, and I came back outside, and it was not snowing anymore. 
Peachy, what's it like with no school? I have like, I don't know what to call it. One of my friends calls it like school PTSD, but I don't know if I should use that term just, you know, cause I don't know if it's actual like medical PTSD, but basically uh, I have this thing where I wake up early morning and I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna be late for work. Or, oh my God, I'm gonna be late for college. Like I have, an, I have a 9 a.m. lecture. I don't even go to school and my work is at home. So I was like, what am I doing? Like, I just have those momentary panics of like, oh my God, I'm gonna miss school and I'm not even in school. But then back when I was in school, I would wake up and I would be like, why am I panicking? I have nothing to do. And then I'm like, wait, I have school. So. How's it being a YouTube, a YouTuber or a YouTube? You meant YouTuber. Um, It's rewarding, but it's also really hard work. It's It's tough. I don't know if I could go back and choose. I don't know if I would choose this exactly because it it took a long time and it took a lot of mental health to get to where I am now. A lot of draining mental health moments, but it's rewarding because I have you guys. My dream. Do I ride IRL? I do not. I don't have a barn around me, sadly. We're gonna run around the property a little bit. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's the two statues. What is this? Excuse me. What are you floating on? Do barrels? That's a good idea. I'll gallop back around to the arena. Oh my gosh, look. It's the cow. I don't I haven't picked a name for her, but you guys left a ton of suggestions on my on my Oasis Valley video, so I'll probably just do that. You're so kind, thank you. Five minute walk away, I wish. Whenever I had to go for lessons and stuff, when my dad used to take me and like surprise me with lessons, it would be like such a long drive away, like an hour or two away. Bye, thank you so much for joining. 10 minutes away in car. It is so expensive. And like, I know, I know a lot of, you know, instructors and stuff, they work really hard and they do deserve to be paid well, but it's really tough sometimes because like some lessons are like two or $300 a lesson. Like a, one of the barns I went to was like $200 for a lesson. And it's like, yeah, that's fun and all, but like $200 for like an hour lesson. And like when I was being, when I had my lesson, I think my lesson was like 80 for like 40 minutes or something. She didn't even tell me what to do. She was just letting me like walk around on the horse and being like, okay, like elbows out or something. And I'm like, out or like out or like, what do you mean by out? And she didn't give me any direction. And I felt really bad about it because I was like, how am I supposed to learn how to ride if this instructor isn't telling me what to do? So it was a really sad moment, but I do know that a lot of instructors, they work hard. So I just want a place where I can go tack up a horse and go and ride for a bit somewhere. Like not even just, I wouldn't even say like get a lesson. I would say just go for a trail ride or something. And that's why I kind of want my own horse and my own like responsibility of a horse because then I can go and care for it. It would be responsibility and money, sure. I mean like fairy work, vet work, you know, the actual stuff that you need to care for a horse like feed shavings all the equipment but at the same time it's like that's your horse you know like you get to care for it you get to own it but yeah my lessons are like 40 dollars oh my gosh wait you guys want to share where you guys go please for asking for a friend it's a lot of money There's a lot of things I want to do, but I just, it's not that I don't have the money right now. It's also, I just don't have the time and I feel like it'll be rewarding when I do have the money and the time. So yeah, you're playing Uno. Did you win? If you didn't win, I'm going to have to ban you from the stream. I'm sorry. I only allow Uno winners. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. Really? 
Yeah, a lot of people like the the barn that's closest to me is like 30 45 minutes and it's in Missouri cuz I'm on the border. Um border between states and they said that I could ride there but I have to actually lease a horse and I was like okay how much is leasing a horse and they're like $500 a month plus stable care plus lessons if you want to get it and I was like oh my gosh and I was like I'm sorry I don't have that kind of money right now and they were like oh well if you lease a horse you it's it's only your horse like you'll be this only singular lease on that horse that's why it's so expensive and I was like is there a horse that's already being leased I can like go have these on with somebody and they were like no we only lease horses out to one person at a time. And I was like, oh my gosh, why? That's way too much money, I'm sorry. But like stable care, obviously that's gonna be a lot of money because that's actually caring for a horse. I can understand the stable care part of it, but $500 a month to go there once a week and ride a horse plus the lesson fee? I was like, that's way too much money, I'm sorry. And I, okay, so I actually considered it for like a week or two. I called them and stuff and I looked on their website. Their horses, their horses do not look healthy at all. Like one of them, I watched a video and it's literally walking on its ankle. And I was like, are your horses okay? Is that horse lame? And she was like, well, a lot of our horses are rescues. So of course they're going to look like, you know, not like warm bloods. I'm like, no, I'm not talking about how they look. Like they look cute. Don't get me wrong. Like they look like good horses, but they look like they're lame. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. New York. Oh my God. I cannot imagine how much it is. So but obviously I, I'm not going to hate on the barn and I'm not obviously not going to like say what barn it was because it was like a family owned barn and I don't want to publicly like shame them or something. But I was really disappointed with how they handled it. Um, but I just I left it at that and I told them thank you for the offer and thank you for like giving me the information, but I'm not going to not going to ride there. Um, they also didn't have an arena. Their arena got flooded and they never replaced it. So they only had a trail system. So there was really no place for me to ride the horse if I actually wanted to like pursue lessons. And yeah. I don't know. There's like those monthly expenses that you really want to get done, but you're not sure if you should. Like I really want my nails done, but I'm like, mm that much money spent on nails I don't know or like eyelash extensions which I don't need I feel like my eyelashes are long enough or like just monthly expenses like extensions or something on your hair it's like you have to get done every four to six weeks and it's like do I really need that if I get it done I'm gonna have to get it redone and redone it's like it's too much too much work what are you at you're at speed three jump two let's go jump some stuff oh my gosh BE events. Oh my gosh. You're so lucky. And five minutes too? Five minute walk? I wish. You should move to New York. The lessons at my barn are cheap. We have 10 lesson horses for all levels. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on a second. I'm packing my bags. That's actually a really good idea. Not to New York though. I'm sorry. New York scares me. The drivers there scare me, I'm sorry. But to your barn, maybe. I might do it for your barn. I don't know. I don't know if I'll be very good at riding because I haven't done it in so long, but how do horses get jumped when I haven't jumped them? Um, it's just from training. And maybe from bucking. Not sure. We're just taking her over here to do some jumps. She's a wish in her horse, but she's an all-around horse technically, so. Hearse. Can you name a horse tank from my horse tank because he served in the army? Maybe. The music stopped. You gonna you gonna play another song? No, no, it is not. I have to do it manually. I have a playlist, but it only has so many songs on it. That means I've been streaming for a while, doesn't it? 
How long have I been streaming? Hold on. Where is it? About an hour. Okay. It's like Streamlabs. Streamlabs isn't telling me how long I've been streaming. Excuse me. Hi, Charlotte. Yeah, there was this one lesson that my dad brought me to because he would surprise me like every so often with a lesson. We went like a trail ride with me and my sister and then I went to an English lesson and the lady was like, I am like a, a verified instructor. I have all these trophies and stuff. And I'm like, oh my gosh, okay, go off queen. Like this is going to be a good lesson, right? And I rode this horse named Sunny. She was super sweet, um, but she was very lazy. And she was like, I want to put you on this horse that's really energetic, but he's too energetic and you're like a beginner rider. And, and I was like, no, I completely understand because I'm going to get thrown off. Like, I do not want to be tossed into the sand. Please don't make me get on this horse. So we tacked up Sunny and Sunny literally would not go above a trot. And her trot was like a half walk. And she's like, oh, silly Sunny. And I didn't really get to do anything that entire lesson because she couldn't get Sunny to go above a trot because Sunny was listening to her. See, that was the lesson is like we were in like a round pen and she was like Sunny was listening to the instructor. So every time I would like, you know, use my heels to get Sunny to go up a gate, she wouldn't. So it was really difficult because like when you, okay, basically like when you're on a lesson and somebody's leading the horse with like a, a lead or something, is that really a lesson? I don't know. So I was I was kind of bummed about that because I was like, oh, she hasn't listened to me. She's like, oh, well, she listens to me when she wants to go up a gate. So just let me tell her to go up a gate. I was like, oh, OK. And then the next time she's like, OK, get Sunny to go up a gate. And I tried and it wouldn't work. She's like, OK, Sunny, trot. And Sunny would start trotting. I'm like, really? I feel like I should not be holding these reins right now. But yeah, that was the most expensive lesson I've ever had, too. It was uh, it was great. Oh my gosh. I hope you're okay, Emily. Yeah, and then I I stayed over at my best friend's house a lot in Washington and I went to visit her when we moved. And she has this horse named Smokey. That was her stepdad's. And um I was able to canter like first time on him and it was really fun too because he he's like a mustang um american quarter horse and he just has like a really lopy canter and it was really sweet because it just it feels like you're on like a really big horse but you're not you're on like a horse that's a little bit taller than you or that you're a little bit taller than i guess i don't know his head was above me so i guess he's taller than me because it's withered a uh, hoof yeah yeah i don't know I feel like lunging should be to get used to the horse and like the, the rhythm and stuff. Like, okay, we're gonna lunge on the horse. You can get used to riding the horse. That way you can take lead. But like lunging the entire time, I feel like you're just paying for, paying for them to exercise the horse. No, honestly, I wanted Barbie horse adventure so bad. When I was a kid, I wanted that game so badly. And even now I'm like, I, I'm an adult. I can buy the game if I want to, and I'm tempted to just to experience it. But I don't know. What is she at now? She's at jump two still. She's at speed three. We're gonna head home and pasture her with Teramisu. Hi, Riley. Thank you for helping me get back in the dimension, by the way. I was low-key stuck. <laughs> I thought I had it pinned, what you said, because I knew it was the same It was the same command as the Sui server when I used to get to VIP, but I just didn't know the dimension world. So that helped a lot. Thank you for that. Pumpkin is so cute. She really is. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen someone use a lunging whip on a horse because it's meant to like, it's meant to go on the ground for them to like hear the vibration, you know, 
Waves this way. Yeah. Not hear the vibration. Feel the vibration, sorry. It's meant to like make a noise to make to encourage the horse to go forward. That's why you're not supposed to use it on the horse. I had a friend said she had someone use a lunge whip on a horse, and I'm like. That's um that's not okay. <laughs> Um, uh oh, did I glitch her? Anyways, we're not going to talk about that. I think I glitched her, but I'll figure that out later. We're going to bring you guys to the pasture, your little personal pasture. Yes, Emily. Two hours now? Has it really been two hours? to no it's only been an hour i was about to say i was like wait did i tell time wrong it's about it been about almost an hour and 15 minutes what did you say to me square up so i thought mm -hmm. okay new horse i don't really know what to do with you i'm just gonna leave you until i can figure out something to do with you Oh my gosh, Casey, 25 years, holy crap. Wait, can we go see the babies that were born? I forgot I bred the two cows. Are you guys still pregnant? Raw chicken. Winter, autumn, wait. Oh wait, here's a cow, that's Moo Jr. I did breed them, but they're not pregnant anymore, and the babies are nowhere to be found. It's weird. Raw chicken. What do you mean dam? It doesn't have a dam, apparently. Jingles and Autumn are going to have a baby. Twenty-two years? Twenty-one years? Oh my gosh, we're the same age. You go off, Queen. And then here are the other horses. We have Firefly. We have Malibu. And then there's Blue. These guys stay in here together. Firefly's kind of been separated from them. Like, she doesn't really go near them. Blue and Malibu kind of stay together in the same area. And then the personal pasture, we have Antari, Gooseberry, Rosé. Um, where's Rosé? Right here. And I think that's it. And then Pumpkin and Teramesu stay up here. I know, Acorn, I've been streaming so late. I'm sorry for you. I've been streaming so late, GMT-wise. We can go ahead and... What, what level is Antari? Antari could really use some training. Wait, are you guys both purple? Oh, no, she's magenta. I forgot. This music reminds me of How to Train Your Dragon. Let's go get Rosé some training. Thank you, Emily. You're so sweet. I'm 
my gosh, Maisie, you have such a busy life. I could not imagine. We're going to do some training on Rose. She needs to get some training done. I don't know. I always thought I had a busier life because I've been like working, but I feel like I don't have a busy life like travel wise because I don't travel often. And if I do, it's because I have to go somewhere with my family. Like I have to drive my family somewhere. And I feel like that's a problem. But at the same time, traveling costs money. I don't got a lot. So oh. sorry for whoever I just made yawn. Matt, if you're still watching, don't yawn, please. Um, No, but like I want to travel more in 2023 but I think I'm gonna start using like travel sites because I have a lot of friends who they're like 24 25 and she said when she was my age she used like the travel sites and get like really good deals on hotels in different routes and she said she only spent like five or six hundred per trip and I was like ooh, don't mind if I do France and Belgium next year with school what kind of school kind of school do you go to Suddenly makes me want to go back to school. My public schools could never when I was a kid. I do plan on a lot for 2023. Plan on visiting, going to the UK, plan on going to Florida again for like a little friends trip. Plan on going to Tennessee to see Hannah again. Oh, you have to pay. Okay. Understandable. Can you come to my school in Florida? It's called Jupiter Middle School. Oh my gosh, maybe. Be like one of those content creators that just show up at people's school and like give out toys and gifts and stuff. About to be modern day Santa Claus. Oh, thank you, Braylon. What did you miss? Nothing nothing too bad. Um, I'm just training Rosé right now. Um, we're up to jump two. I probably from rearing, yeah. That makes sense. Trying to get up to speed two. Oh my gosh, yes. I had so many mean math teachers. I will help you out. I got you. No, my spelling teachers... My vocabulary teachers and my math teachers were always so mean. But my math teacher was also my PE teacher and my science teacher because I went to a private school for like a year. Well, a year and a half. And then I dropped out of the school and moved to public the next year because it was so bad. It was an excuse for a private school, honestly. The private schools are always like the ones that like don't really care for the kids. At least in the US. I don't know about other countries' private schools. I don't know why I'm yawning so bad. I'm sorry. My science teacher is an angel. That's good. My English and grammar teacher, she was so sweet. I miss her so much. She would like bring little candies for everyone every day. And there was this one day that I forgot my lunch because I just, I guess I was moving too quick in the morning and I just got into the car and re like remembered, oh my gosh, I forgot my lunch on the counter. And my mom just wasn't able to bring it to me that day. So, um... I just went without lunch and I like was sitting in her classroom like 10 minutes early for class because I wasn't at lunch. I just walked around the <laughs> I just walked around the uh the school until lunch was over and she's like, "Why are you in the classroom so early?" She's like, "They dis they dismissed you for lunch that early." And I was like, "No, I didn't bring lunch, so I didn't even go to the lunch room." And she was like, what do you mean you didn't bring lunch? And I was like, well, I forgot it at home. And my mom, I think my mom was like working that day or something. There was something wrong where she couldn't bring me lunch. Um, and she was like, oh, okay. And she like pulled out this extra salad out of her bag. And she was like, I always like, sometimes when I work later, I always bring like an extra salad with me. And she just gave it to me. And I was like, oh my God. And then she ate with me and we talked about life. And it was really sweet. And I was only in sixth grade too, like with a sixth grader. It was so sweet. Yeah, see, like, in a lot of countries, private schools are, like, these schools to be. 
They cost a lot of money, but they're like some of the best schools, like good education, good good uh, teachers. This private school was like a private religious school, and it was a, an excuse for a school. I'm sorry, but <laughs> even to this day, I will always like resent a lot of the teachers for what they did to the students and what they didn't do to the students to discipline them. And a lot of students were like treated horribly at that school. So food is free. Oh my God. Twenty five K a year. Oh my god. Made my brain hurt a little bit. I don't know. Like if if a student really likes the school, I feel like no student really like loves school, but if you make friends and everything and you're learning a lot, I feel like you'd like school. But I had ADD slash ADHD. Haven't like I was unofficially diagnosed. I don't really know what I got yet. Um, but it was really hard to concentrate in class because I was like always trying to concentrate on my studies but there was so much going on that I couldn't concentrate for example one of my um one of my teachers played music during class and that was like the most concentrated I've ever been in class and but the other students were like we can't concentrate I'm like I can leave it on so I was actually taken out of that class though because I skipped a year of math and I didn't understand what was going on so they had to put me in like lower math I was always horrible at math but I caught up when I was in college, so it's all good. Let's see what I'm at. Speed two. Okay, we can go put her back now. Go put her back in the pasture. You guys ready for this jump? She wasn't. She's like, oh, I'm back here again. Okay. Severely unrealistic way to do it, but yeah. Welcome back. Hi, Samurai. Welcome. Math is really difficult, and because I, I'm just a visual person, and the way math works, I couldn't really visualize it in my head, so it's very difficult to understand, but that's why I, like, thrived with things like matrices and things where you could, like, write it down physically on paper and solve it that way, rather than just using, like, a calculator and stuff, so yeah, do you have a Minecraft server? I do, I'm on my Minecraft server right now, it's not open to the public yet, we're working on it, I will be giving updates soon, anyways, um, I think that's it for today. I wasn't planning on streaming for like a really long time, but at the same time, I'm happy I stuck around for a little bit longer. I love talking to you guys, so I don't mind sticking around for that long. But bye, Tootsie. Um, yeah, graphs. Oh my gosh, graphs. Graphs are always my favorite, especially like the little block graphs. Do you guys remember like these little, these little block games where they let you like put the graphs in and like measure how many blocks there were. <sighs> That's why I loved graphs, but yeah. Anyways, um, I'm going to head out. Um, I have a stream again on Wednesday. Let me tell you guys my schedule so you guys are up to date. I have Red Dead Redemption 2 story mode on Wednesday at 3 p.m. Central, and then Friday, another 3 p.m. Central for Medieval Dynasty. And then on Saturday, the 17th, hear me out Saturday the 17th we are doing group among us with friends um, I made it a little bit earlier in the day so it's not too late for like my GMT friends and I'm also going to be inviting staff members as well so from my server so you guys can drop by and visit and see us betray each other in among us because we do that a lot I don't betray anybody in among us I'm a very pure person in among us very wholesome I don't murder anybody. But yeah, anyways, so um, the server is not up for members. No, it's only for personal friends right now and filming and also staff members because we're getting it set up. But yeah, okay, guys. I hope everyone has an amazing rest of your day. Um, make sure to watch my newest video if you guys have the time because it has a lot of fun stuff for the CIT pack that Moonflower made. But yeah, um, I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Stay healthy and safe, and I will see you in the next video or stream. Make sure to stay hydrated and warm. It is freezing cold in my room right now. My legs are forming goosebumps. I need to go put slippers on and leggings on. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys for joining today's stream and being so sweet and talkative. Have a good rest of your day, everyone. Goodbye.